Box 59 was a heater. The actual Box 59, not the first one that had to have a little text put into the video. So this one, this is actual Box 60. It was the limit that I said I would open. Um, definitely could use some fresh trade bait. Um, I'm running out. I'm going to probably start putting all of the autos oh we got a gold putting all of the autos up um for sale at the cheapest prices that i i can tolerate for all the ones i have left so if you're putting together a set of anything any of the auto sets or if you're a collector of a certain person watch for those uh they will be trying to use them to trade as much as I could, um, but if I can't, then I'm going to, uh, if I can't trade them, I'm just going to sell them off and, and hopefully end up with no duplicates. All of my individual like base cards, all my reds, all my blues, all my classics, all my classics gold, all my base iconics, historics, all those are going to be put into individual uh what i'm going to call starter set um so every unique one that i have as a duplicate is going to end up as a listing as a starter set for that set so if you're trying to put it together whether you're starting it or whether you're a little ways along those will do uh, a lot of good in getting um getting you started or getting you closer to completion so and then I'll have my duplicate duplicates, anything that I have um, multiples of will be still available for trade. Um, but those starter sets, I'd, I'd like to sell off. They're, they seem to be doing really well on eBay. Not a lot of people making them, um, but they're being bought up uh, by people putting stuff together. So we have a Classics Gold Nate Doss out of 25. We got an Artifacts. Will Shoestrick Blue out of 50. Oh, it's a Ken Climo Artifacts. Guess what? I needed that because I bought the one from the auction. Oh my god, I can't believe the two boxes I opened. Uh, this is the last Artifacts I needed. Technically, I bought the errored one that didn't have, well, not error. But it didn't have the the autograph and it didn't have the serial number so this one completes my set of artifacts awesome i would have considered that the other one counted for the set but i now that i got it i'll, I'll keep them both nice little base card here robert burridge iconics rookie card and out of 100 and then a val mondejano base out of 100. keep hitting box keep hitting We have Chris Dickerson Classics out of 100. Eric McCabe, we got a Relics. Red out of 75. Relics. Nicholas Antela out of 25. <clears throat> Scott Stokely, Iconics Base out of 100. And Page Shoe Historics out of 100. All right, come on, hit, hit one of those. Hit me some autos that I need. How about a Holly Finley Timeless? I haven't seen it anywhere. I know someone else looking for it too. The ever popular father of the games. That is. I can't even read it. Uh, inventor. PDGA. Founding of the PDGA. So that's I believe six. Uh, Mason Ford Blue. Out of 50. Adam Hammes, Timeless, Auto out of 50, Kyle Klein, Black out of 25, and a Nate Sexton Base. Pack 3. Classics, David Wiggins Jr. out of 100. Uh, David Wiggins, Red out of 75. Maria Oliva, that's the third or fourth one of these I have. Uh, Iconics Auto out of 25. Jay Yeti Ready and Iconics. And then Owen Scoggins Base out of 100. 
Last pack. Feels thick. Could be another relic. Could be a royalty. Could be a couple extra thick cards thrown in. That would be pretty nice. You know, if they wanted to... Oh, another great basket case. Paige Pierce Classics. Out of 100. Steady Ed basket case. Out of 15. That's awesome. We got the regular base relics. It's not one I need. Bradley Williams. So that's up for trade. Bear Bite Disc Iconics base out of 100. And a Chris Clemens Historics out of 100. So I'm going to get these sorted. Check my lists. Start crossing things off. And I, I'm going to say right now that's probably it for me opening boxes. I think I still have a few left. I definitely want to save a few for down the road. Something I've never done before. Um, I'm currently doing that. I have a couple extra of the relics and the signature boxes from DGPT. Um, I may do some box breaks with some of the extras, but I definitely am going to hold on to a few unopened boxes. Um, just because. It's part of the fun. So... I ended up with 20, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. 19 unopened gold packs plus the one I opened. So that's 20 total out of 60 boxes. So I was stating I was at 19 out of 60, but because I had forgotten about the two boxes I op or didn't open, um, from my initial orders of 60, um, I sold one off and sold packs out of another on my website for people that didn't want to buy a whole box. Um, I know one, at least one of the boxes I sold. Uh, so I sold out, a, um, put three more boxes up right after Brixton sold out. And then... Because I just wasn't having any luck selling them. And I also put up, I think, three boxes of packs. Uh, and sold out of that stuff within 30 minutes of Simon posting his video. So, uh, but that was all I really wanted to, to sell off at, up front. Um, we'll see what I'm going to do with the rest. Uh, let me know if you want to get in a break or something. I might do some of that. Um haven't really done it before, so it would be totally new for me. I'm just opening for me. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe as you see fit. And definitely hit me up on social media if you want to make some trades. Uh, I am purchasing some of the low dollar cards right now. Um, the prices have come down a fair amount from where they started. Um, so, you know, like Timeless or... 2015 maybe to 35 dollars a piece unless you get a really big name uh reflections are down to 30 to 40 40 ish um relics are about 45 for an average person more for big names obviously um so i'm i am starting to buy up some of the cards that i need because i i'm running out of trade material um so if you want to check my list out hit me up um i have it posted on the brixton discord and i need to update it but it is on the disc golf trading card page uh on facebook too but i have it so if you want just hit me up and i'll get you a fresh one since i was making trades pretty much every few hours for the last week um it's been pretty pretty crazy pretty awesome trades a lot of value going back and forth but uh if it helps me get closer to the set, I want to do it. So, all right, that's it. Thanks, everyone.